Welcome to this episode of Shift. I'm your host, Palmonia Gordon. Today, I just wanted to talk to us about mentors. I'm not sure how many of you have a mentor, how many of you know what a mentor is, how many of you desire to get with a mentor. A uh, mentor is someone who sort of impart their knowledge to you, the information that they know. Usually, it's somebody who has had a certain level of success in maybe an area of business or life that you're interested in. Maybe somebody may mentor you on a, excuse me, spiritual level. You may have somebody mentor you on a emotional level, uh, somebody who mentors you in business. Did I introduce myself? Hi, I'm your host, Palmonia Gordon. <laughs> I have a background in corporate America, I'm a mom, I'm a speaker, I'm an author, author of the book entitled Order It, A Guide to Manifesting Your Dreams. And I just wanted to ask if you have a mentor and if you don't, I'm just going to encourage you to find one. Today with technology, what's beautiful is you don't even have to know them personally. Here's the truth. They could dead, be dead and gone and they could still be mentoring you because technology allows us to keep the information that has been documented over time, information that's still relevant today. I get a lot of my mentoring through, you can guess, I'm a nerd. This is actually one of my favorite book. I think I recently did an episode uh, speaking about wealth and how rich are we and this is just one of those book where i felt i was in heaven like oh my god because it made me realize that so much of what i do is okay <laughs> you know when you do things or you may have little um routines and system that just kind of seem outside the box like one of mine, I've always lived my life saying in everything, give thanks. Doesn't matter what it is. Doesn't matter how bad it is. I'm always, okay, thank you. It's like, man, you kind of really an oddball. You know, somebody step on and talk, okay, thank you. But thank you. So, but when you, when you read this book, um, Today We Are Rich, it really just brings home the truth of, gratitude and in it they say gratitude is like a rocket fuel it literally boosts you into places and areas that you would have never thought or dreamed were possible and it's just because it comes from having a spirit of gratitude just being grateful that this is where i'm at this is what i have and i'm just going to be thankful for it Another favorite of mine is this one called uh, Psycho Cybernetics. And this one is all about the focus on how you see yourself. Because how we perceive ourselves very much affect who we become and how we live our life from day to day. So these are just some of the examples of mentors. Oh, sorry, I didn't bring any Lisa Nichols book. I got a couple of her books as well. And... So who are your mentors? Do you have your mentor? Is, yes, it could be, I was going to say, it could be your spouse, but it's a different kind of relationship. It's more maybe of a mentor confidant, somebody where you're able to talk and share your day with. And sometimes the challenge, speaking from personal experience, it may be hard sometimes getting the taking the advice of your spouse because... You may figure they either know you too well or something, but right. But ideally, a mentor is someone outside of the a relationship that you're in, and they want to teach you, they want to help you, they want you to grow. And it's usually someone that you trust and respect on such a deep level that you don't really question too much what they say, and you are always open and receptive. Uh, there was a gentleman that was recently here from Dubai and he came to one of uh, Toastmatter meet meeting that we had and he said he went to his mentor and his mentor basically sh explained to him that there are three kinds of people in the world. Those who are 
contented. They're living life the way they want it. Those who compromise, they don't really have what they want, but mm, they're making do for now, hoping that someday they'll get to content. And then there are those who just complain. And he asked him, well, who, which one of the three would you like to be? So I'm, I share that example to say a mentor will do stuff like that. They'll just kind of be ballsy. Oh, maybe I'm a mentor. I'm sorry, because I'm just thinking, oh, yeah, sometimes I kind of ask you all some tough questions. And yes, a mentor, they will do that. They will help you shift the way you're thinking, the way you speak, the way you see things. Because their aim is to move you to a better place. They see you at a greater potential that, and then you're able to see yourself right now. And that's their job. So if you don't have one, find one. Uh, coach is another great resource that many of us, we, we shy away from. I don't know why we, we place so many things in a box. I only need a coach if, or I only need a coach when. It's something that you need for life, really. That's why we have best friends. Do you know best friends are coaches? Why do you have a best friend? And why when something happens, if that's not true and we don't need a coach, why when something happens, the first thing you do as you meet somebody is, oh, so, so can I tell you what happened to me? And you start sharing. Because coaching and mentoring is a natural part of life. It's something that we gravitate towards. It's something that keeps us shifting and help us to grow. And it's just a natural part of who we are. So it's not a bad thing. Being a great friend, you could be the best coach for someone. So I want to encourage you today on this episode of Shift to find a mentor, find a coach. And a coach is a little bit different because the program is more specific and typically they're paid. You have to usually pay a coach. You give them money, they give you service. Whereas the mentor, on the other hand, is someone who has such deep knowledge and insight and they take pleasure in imparting that to them, to someone, you know, around them before they go. As a matter of fact, uh, last year I was in a training with John C. Maxwell and he said, one of the things you should do, he encourages you to do, is when you meet someone that's older than you, that succeeding in an area that you would like to succeed in, you should actually ask them, tell me what the next 10 years will be like. Because if they are ahead of you and they are 10, 20 years, you know, up on you or more, they have already lived where you are at. So he says, you should ask them, tell me what the next 10 years will be like. So, it's almost like getting a free roadmap that you can prepare and guide and says, okay, I can check this off and, and, and watch for the signs and the cues as you travel on this roadmap called life. Thank you for joining me on this episode of Shift. I know it wasn't all oh, let's scream and there and jump over anything, but I believe mentors are very important. They are instrumental in, in my life. I... I, I mean, in, in books, in emails, in workshops, in seminars, I just have a constant flow of mentors and coach because if you, if you doubt what I'm saying, go to my very, very first YouTube video that's entitled Ugly. <laughs> oh, and you will see the difference and the growth that I've experienced just by having a mentor and having coaching and having people who have done it that are guiding me on the right path. I love you. I stood up there today because I wanted to see, try it out. Have a good day. 60 tiny ticks. The second hand ticks 60 seconds before it becomes one minute. I'm encouraging you to keep ticking. Take small moves, connect with somebody, reach out to somebody, walk with me for this 60 second. And when you're at a minute, if you need them to walk with you for the hour, you ask them, could you walk with me for the hour? 
And then when you get to a place where you're able to walk on your own, then you can walk with somebody on their 60 minute as they shift. Because we have to shift from where we are so we can step into and order the person, the dream, the life that you were meant to live. Mentors are a great way to do that. I'm a coach. You can visit my website, palmoniagordon.com. I'd love to get you some information, send you some free resources. Like, comment, subscribe to this page. And see you again tomorrow as we keep shifting. I love you.